Yard Class One, Vocabulary Lesson One. In the series of vocabulary videos, we will go through few words in each video and meaning. Understand their meaning with pictures and sentences. And for some words, we will also learn how to correctly spell these words. So let us start with our first vocabulary lesson. The very first word is big. Here, big means large in size. You can see two balls here. The first ball is big in size. Then we compare it to the other ball, which is small in size. So, our first word is big. Let us see the sentence associated with this. How to use big in sentence? Mound a big mound a big ball in the shop. So here we are telling something about the size of the ball, the object ball, right? So B I G big. B sound, E sound, and G sound. Big. Next word is family. Family. As you already know, family is a unit where all the members live. Stay together, live together, eat together, and they love each other. Family. How to spell it? Fat. Me. Leave. Family. Leave. Family. Let us see use of word family in sentences. First one is this family has four members. Next, I have a wonderful family. My grandfather is the head of the family. Next is, next is, we should love our family. So, in all these sentences, we have used the word family. You can go through each sentence and understand how this word is used in sentences when we want to convey our ideas or thoughts. Next word is father. Father. Another name for father is papa or daddy or dad right here the father is holding his son let us see how word father is used in sentences in the first sentence i love my father second my father is a teacher. Third, I went for a walk with my father. And the last one, my father cooks delicious food for us. So these are just few example sentences so that you can have an idea that how these words are used to form meaningful sentences. Next is mother. Very simple word and it's already known to you. Mother. Mother is your mom or mommy. 
right let us see use of word mother in sentences i love my mother the baby feels safe in his mother's lap my mother is a pilot here we have highlighted is it is just to make you understand that whenever we are talking about a single object we use is right next mother is the best gift from god so this is how you can use the word mother in sentences next word is brother brother is your sibling right i have an elder brother elder means someone your your sibling who is your elder who is big in age my brother is a singer my elder brother gave me a pencil i love playing with my brother so there are two words elder and younger like elder brother is bigger than you in age and younger brother is little brother your little brother next word is sister sister is also your sibling in the first sentence i have a younger sister like your little sister my sister is good in studies his sister is going for a cycle race i love playing with my sister so its pronunciation is sister let us see how will we learn its spelling we will divide this whole word into small portions so that we can learn it better sis t right next word is wear wear that means having something on your body let us see how this word is used in sentences hey friend wear your scarf scarf is a cloth that is used to wear on your head next sentence my sister is wearing a good dress right i love to wear watch on my wrist so something that you are putting on your body you can say that i am wearing it we should wear clean clothes wear so how will you learn spellings of wear here w sound w ear wear wear next word is pretty 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 means something which is looking very beautiful charming right pretty first of all how will you learn its spelling pr a t pet e pretty pretty like you can also learn it this way pret e pretty 
or pretty. Let us use this word in sentences. What a pretty dress. The girls are looking so pretty. So, here we have used are because we are talking about more than one object. When we are use when we are talking about something plural, we use are or were or have. Last sentence is I look pretty in this skirt. Pretty. Next word is dress, dress, like here, this is a frock, the dress can be any, it can be a coat or pant or something like you wear, dress. How will you learn the spelling of dress? D -a -dr -a -s. A hissing sound is here, so double S, dress, dr S. Dress. Let us see how to use this word dress in sentences. What a pretty dress. This is my school dress. We are talking about a single object. So we are using here is. This is my school dress. Third sentence. My dress is blue in color. Is because we are talking about a single thing. Last sentence. Go and change your dress. Dress. Dr -a -s. So hissing sound is here. So dress. Next word is play. Play. This is something your favorite thing, right? You love to play. So how will you learn spellings of play? A sound, l sound, l. And a, play, play. Let us use word play in sentences. First one is let us play football. I want to play with Ria. Now here the point to remember is that when we are talking about someone and we are like using his or her name, the names should begin with a capital letter, Ria. Instead of writing it like this, Ria, which is wrong because it's a proper noun. The names of person should begin with a capital letter when we write them in sentences. I want to play with Ria. Next sentence. My teacher want me to take part in a play. A play. Here play is an act. Right? Last sentence, what do you want to play today? So play. There are some other words having similar sounds. So if you learn the spellings of play, pl a, you can also, will, you, it will be easier for you to write those spellings. The other words that are sounding same like play, like clay. Say, right? You can learn, you can think about so many words that are having same sound called homophones, and you can write those practice write practice writing those words having the same sounds, and this way you can learn so many spellings. Play, clay, say.
Another one is coming into my mind now. Tray. So A Y is making A sound here. A. Right? Pl. Play. Cl. Clay. S. Say. Tr. Tray. So these are the 10 words which we have learned in this video. First one is just recapitulating. First one is big. B -e -g, big. Family. Fa me -li, family. This is how you will Divide this whole spelling, whole word into small parts so that you can learn them easily. This way you will be able to learn the spellings easily. Right? Family. Brother. Br. The. And there is R. Brother. Mother. Ma. The. R. Mother, father, fa, the, r, father. Where, w sound comes from w, where, and then there is air, where. Play, pl, and a, play. Dress, dre, Dress. Pretty. Pray. Tea. Pretty. Sister. S I S sis and then T E R ter. Sister. So this is how you can learn the spellings easily for the difficult words. Like these are the easier one, but I'm just giving you an idea of how you can learn difficult words, right? You have to divide those words into smaller parts and learn the small sounds first and then try to combine those small sounds to make it a proper word, the bigger sound, which is the phonic of the word actually. So, like here, family, we have divided it into three, family, right? So, this way you can learn each part, sound of each part and then combine it to make the whole word. So, there are some sample questions that can come in your Olympiad examinations related to vocabulary. Like the first one is filling the blank with appropriate word, appropriate or accurate word. He loves to dash with his little brother. Play. Okay, that makes sense. Clothe. No. He loves to clothe his little brother. No. Knife. No. And wood. No. So this is the appropriate option. Next question. What object is shown in the picture? Body. No. Dress. Yes. Water. No. Cloud. No. So body is the right answer. Select the incorrect spellings from the following options. Incorrect. So you have to, like your vocabulary must be strong and you must understand the, how the spellings are formed for various uh, words. In that way, you will be able to answer these questions very well. So let us see the options. Fa the, the father. This is correct. Mother. No, this is incorrect. It should be mother. Mother. Sister. Correct. Brother. Brother. This is correct. So, incorrect answer is option is this. So, this is the answer for this question. So, students, you can visit our website at olympiadpreparation.in for further studies and further preparation. 
and stay tuned for more videos and shine in various Olympiads. Thank you. Kindly subscribe the channel for more such educational videos on various Olympiads.